I can just screw my Professor Brian Cox head on. That's better, there we go. <laughs> Quantum mechanics, a fascinating field, subatomic interactions that may not be revealed through science as we commonly understand it. It operates to a different standard. Take light, it's a wave and a particle, but just how much of each is kind of article, since the part we call a particle may not be the genuine article. See, according to the principles of Heisenberg, observing light particles doesn't work, since the act of observing makes them swerve and changes their nature. It's bound to frustrate you. It can fry your brain, it can blow your mind, but I'll try to explain. Quantum mechanics. Get with the beat of the place where physics and philosophy meet. Quantum mechanics. Universe shrinking calls for a whole new level of thinking. Quantum mechanics. Things that may be and may not be as well simultaneously. See a team at the University of Toronto had an idea and by heck they're onto something. They called it weak, weak measurement. measurement. They studied the momentum of photons that went through a sliver of calcite and made observations not of the photons but their deviations. Eureka. Another piece falls into place of the unsolved disco of time and space. This will trajectory along which light waves whiz is like a particle yes, it is. a victory for visionary physicists nice one lads now go on and get pissed <laughs> you're looking astounded but it's easy once you've gotten your head around it mechanics. intellectual giants forging ahead with a new kind of science mechanics. getting on down with subatomic particles bouncing around it's awesomely groovy and has nothing to do with that James Bond movie which was frankly quite disappointing and I don't even know why they called it that except well that was the title of an original show short story but it had nothing to do with the short story so I don't really know why they bothered actually.